Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you a few ideas on how to finish the edge of a cardigan. A couple of these techniques are for double bed and a couple for single bed. These are just some ideas that you can use in your own way. I'm sure there are other ways to do this, but I hope you will get inspired anyway. Also, don't forget that you can have access to some extra content and can support my channel over on Patreon. I upload extra videos with projects that I'm working on, extra tutorials and charts and instructions for techniques from my videos here on YouTube. There will be a link for my Patreon in the description down below. First idea that I'm going to show you is my favorite. If you want to achieve a very clean and simple edge, you can do that by using half Milano. So I have just knitted my one by one rib and now we'll transfer all needles on my main bed. We'll leave in action the last three needles on the river bed in order to form six stitches in total. I will grab the pearl bar from the stitches from main bed and river bed and form new stitches like so. I have made a tutorial focusing only on half Milano, so if you would like to check that out, I will leave a link in the description. In order to knit half Milano, all you have to do is to put one of the cams on the river carriage into PR position. I have put the left cam and now we'll knit main bed only when knitting from right to left and both beds when knitting from left to right. So when we knit two rows, we will knit only one row onto the river bed and two rows on main bed. This way the edge will have a lot of structure. When decreasing, transfer stitches from both beds like so. We'll use a 3 prong transfer tool and we'll begin transferring. I like to see the fashioning so we'll transfer 9 stitches on main bed and then the 6 stitches on the river bed to decrease. And this is how the sample looks, really nice and clean and there is no rolling. In order to compare, I knitted this other sample and half of it I knitted all needles on the edge every row and the other half in half Milano. Looking at it, there is not a lot of difference. The only difference is that the half Milano part has more structure and that could be helpful in some designs. Another way you can finish the edge of your cardigan is to, of course, knit a rib and then attach it onto the edge. This is very simple, especially if you have a linker.
we'll show you a couple of ideas if you have a single bed only. The first one is a cardigan edge with a lot of detail. For this demonstration, I cast on waist yarn and will now wrap my final yarn. We'll need a few rows, four or six should be enough to get a nice rolled edge. We'll now do transfers every other needle and we'll leave these needles out of action so I can create ladders. To knead the body, we'll put the floats of the ladders on top of the needles like so to close them up. We'll leave the last three ladders on the edge, and that is potentially the edge of my cardigan. I left two needles in action on the very edge instead of one to get a cleaner edge. This is how you can decrease transfer stitches together with the ladders according to your calculations. This is a very simple technique and I think it could look really nice in the right yarn. Maybe a viscose. And this is the final sample. You can see that the ladders don't allow the edge to curl as much as the opposite side. And the last example I will show you is a folded edge. What I am knitting now is the piece that I will add onto the edge of my cardigan. I have just cast on some waist yarn and will knit with the main yarn without e wrapping. Knit the desired number of rows and then remove the weights. Fold the piece in half and put the stitches from the first row we knitted onto the needles. Make sure you put every single stitch. After that you can remove the waist yarn and we'll knit one more row. Knit a few rows of waist yarn and don't cast off. We'll now add it onto the edge of my cardigan.
To add an extra detail, when linking the piece, we'll place it so that the last row I knitted has the purl side facing me. I think that this is such a subtle little detail. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to subscribe for more videos and I will see you next time!